Some locals in Angelino Heights say their neighborhood is the spot for trick-or-treating. It's also a major cut-through, though, for Dodger Stadium traffic. Some neighbors are now concerned about the two events colliding. And CBS 2's Joe Kwan is live in the area with more. Joe. Pat and Rick, this neighborhood goes all out. As you can see, one, one of these homes in their neighborhood, this is just one decorated because they're expecting thousands of kids. Armando Vigil is getting ready for lots of trick-or-treaters to show up at his door. I'm saying about 15 bags of candy. A few doors down on Carroll Avenue near Douglas Street, Anna Primorak is doing the same. This is the hot spot for Halloween. Neighbors say this intersection at Carroll and Douglas will be jam-packed with kids trick-or-treating after sunset, but this is also a major cut-through for stadium traffic getting between sunset and the 101. It's going to be more dangerous. Uh, for for the for the kids, um, it's bad enough on a regular Halloween when there's not all the the extra cars here for for the Dodgers. Madeline Rofer has lived in Angelino Heights for two decades. There's definitely people running stop signs and speeding and trying to cut around cars that are stopped. Yvonne Sandoval still plans to bring her granddaughter here to trick or treat. This is Halloween night, so they're going to be a little bit more careful. Rofer says she wants the city to put up barriers blocking cars to prevent something bad from happening. So far, we've been lucky. Knock on wood. Primerac says she hopes baseball fans remember. This is their World Series Halloween. A big night for four year old Justin Allen. You get to trick or treat and then you get to eat your candy. All this candy. Locals say this bucket will go in an hour and they buy at least 3,000 pieces. Pat and Rick. See any Reese's in there, Pat? I don't, hey, Joe, if you see some wreath, well, I don't want to take from the children, so let's get I got that. some right here. I'll save one take for you. Okay, thank yeah, you. Right <laughs> Look at him looking at you. <laughs>